Welcome back team. You're Gaming with the Colonel and this is Strategic Command WW2 World at War TRP, the Total Realism Project in the Alpha Stage. We're playing Kublevagen and we're the Axis. When last we left off, we had just taken out France and installed Pétain as the Prime Minister of Vichy, France. Uh, let's see what he did to us today. I am guessing it is now June of 40. So we've got lots of time, and if we have that much time, which you normally don't have, I think it's time to go after Malta and then Egypt. Yeah. That's okay. We'll get our we'll get our planes down there. They'll stop that from happening in a hurry. Italy just now joined the war. They got no part of that uh, that stuff in uh, Af in France. So they're going to have to do something else. Now what we're going to do is we're going to move units that we're going to move. Uh, we'll probably force march them over to the east. The stuff we want to get to Malta, we're going to just go ahead and quickly deploy. And then we're going to fix for our turn. So. Guyana came alive. That was uh, de Gaulle there. Oof. Italy joins. Italy declares one of the allies. Allied naval hinders axis reinforcing. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, Germany celebrates the defeat of France. Franco has given us a port of Vigo in northwest Spain and Santa Cruz in the Canary Islands. That will be helpful. Admiral Rader argues that with the France defeated, we should aim to defeat the British by switching our main emphasis to the Mediterranean. By advancing into Egypt and seizing the Suez Canal, we can strike an effective and painful blow. Success in Egypt would move Spain closer to joining the war. And if our victory in the region is coupled with a vigorous U-boat campaign against British shipping, we could bring her to the we could bring the British to their knees. Organize a large-scale U-boat offensive. Okay. Sounds like a good plan. Uh, work is considering on the Roma. It's continuing on the Roma. So it's been suggested that rather than add another battleship to our fleet, we should instead convert her to an escort carrier named the Aquila. Yeah, we're not going to do that. We like the Roma. Okay, we got our first set of paratroopers, which we will, of course, be getting out over into here as soon as we can, because if there's openness here, we can jump into it, get behind them, and they'll be sucking wind. So that'll be great. Three, three. Can they afford that? He's a seven, he's an eight. Let's detrench him real quick.
Ooh. He got lucky there, that's for sure. Three, three. Should we pop him? We can't. We might as well now while we still can. Four, two. That was better than expected. Um, sure would like to be able to get next to the headquarters. Mistake moving there. What do you have over here? I don't know. Two four on that guy. there is going to be brutal. I really need that hex. That's the hex I need. That is the hex I need. Four. One, that's perfect. Come on, you can do better than that. Perfect. Kill him. Ah. Back them up again. A fighter, what can I do with him that's worthwhile? You move back. So that's good news. Why do you have no action? They're on a road, but it's not helping any. Still need that guy there, and we still haven't transported anybody there yet. And these guys move a, a clip of one per. He can move out of here. He doesn't need to be there. Well, if somebody's got to be uncovered, that's the one to be uncovered, right? To transport these guys, it's 20 money. That's so not worth it.
Once I get my paratroopers over there, I'll be able to jump in behind them. That'll be great. So, 268. I forget what I was doing. I forget what I was doing. I was going to purchase something. I don't remember what it was. So I had mentioned that I needed escort carriers and that I needed, and there's two of those left, and that I need all these pair, these guys right here, these elite guys. These light guys are probably not bad. This guy's really good. I should get him. And then, of course, the elites are for, how much, how much better are the elites? 4-4 four, four versus 4-3. Four, the Mountain Corps is a 4 as well. Escort Carrier is 150. Can't do both. The Mountain Corps would really be good, worthwhile over here, I think. Especially in this area. Research tells us that and only do one chit in each, so we're kind of done there. Because we're not getting tanks or heavy bombers. Okay, let's purchase that mount. God, it's so going against what I want to do, right? But to get that mountain core would really be nice. It's almost 200. Oh, I'm starting to push them back. So I bought two detachments to pull these guys off the line. What if I took you, moved you down here in preparation for better stuff. I think that might not be bad. Let's move you back here. Now let's take you. You come up here. You'll cover that next turn. In the meantime, this guy's going to get moved down to here. Yes, that mountain unit would really be good and useful in here. But we've got so much other stuff to do. You know, more air would be great too. Another tactical bomber, a medium bomber would be fantastic. Wouldn't come out till September. take a while. This guy would get September as well. It'd actually take longer. He can deploy quicker. Be more useful quicker. This guy could detrench people. Which is what I really need over there. Mechanized core. Or I can continue to focus on the Navy, which doesn't suck. Oh, man, that's 
a lot. These are cheap. Don't have a lot of uh, action points. Well, they do. You know what? I like this whole tor torpedo boat idea, and they can come out early, so that's that's good. We're going to buy some of those as well. In the meantime, let's get these last two escort carriers. These I can't get till 42. Yeah, it's, I'm going to need those, so. Okay, so he's being covered by him. He's being covered by him. This guy doesn't need coverage at the moment. I should just go ahead and blow this guy away, although it's going to be expensive. No, we're just going to let him try to retreat him. There's no reason to waste shells on this guy. No reason to do that at all. Meanwhile, back at the ranch... That costs 50. Wow! Fifty to upgrade him. He's forty. He's fifty. That's unbelievably expensive. Fifty. Fifty for the battle cruisers. Sixteen for those guys. They're cheap. Seventy-six. Every MPP counts. All right. Well, let's let's free up some some ports here. The Fuso battle cruiser. Do I have any battleships? Was these guys right? They. Is that the only battleship that I have? What's inbound? I do have a couple of carriers inbound, a couple of more escort carriers. of detachments. I need to free up some ports so that other guys can get in there. So let's get you fixed up. And next turn I can drop another guy in there. We're down to eight now, so we're not doing anything else. Um, but we can drop him down, move him into port. Slowly but surely... Get these guys that need something in there. Okay, you can move out. You can move out. There's supply 11. All right, there we go. That makes sense. Next turn, you can come down here. These guys will also be ready to move, although research tells us that uh, naval weaponry is still a long ways away, and so is anti-sub. Well, research is slow, slow in this game. All right, so we're done with the these guys. The Italians are just in time. 
taken care of that. Not quite sure what's going on here or here. I'm not messing with it. All right, so they have taken away our ports. So we have minimal ability. Is he up there? That's the question. travel too fast. So I've got no supply out here. Let's give us eight. Does not. So you need to get back in here. All right. Come on up over here. You get fixed. This is upgrade to naval weaponry. We definitely want that. This is an upgrade to fighters. We don't want that. And we're going to be bringing those two south next time. All right, we got some subs. Egypt, UK, Surya Vishy. Let's pop this guy onto here. I'd really like to upgrade the battleships too. What did we did we buy did I just screw up? Did we buy the uh yeah, we did. We bought that last turn. Okay. The Andrea Doria needs some reinforcements. Next turn, we need to upgrade these ships. These guys can start marching in the other direction. I do want to take him down to uh, down to Africa here. Don't know if we can make that happen anytime soon. All right, so let's take a look at the Germans here. Well, we might as well finish these guys up. I need a port. You go here. An upgrade. Twelve twenty five. That's only one, I suppose. What else do I need the money for? Nothing at the moment. I'm wondering if I can do some damage to these guys. How much would this hurt him? Let's go find out. T2. Two, two. Two, one. That's not bad. Get up here and steal some money. Three. 
one. Get up here, steal some money. Okay, so we're going to do some damage to you and your economy. And maybe get you in a trap. They need to be upgraded before they can come out. Okay, so that's it for them. Germans. Von Rundstedt is a 7. Bock is a 6. Munstein's a 9. Küchler just got all kinds of good rating here. He's got all, he got all kinds of stuff. But I think we're going to take... Uh, I think we're going to take Rundstedt. And we're going to bring him, hold on, we could just fix him this turn and then operate him next. No, we're going to, we're going to move him this turn. So you operate for 18. Hold on, let's find out what his range is. Okay, my attack bombers have a range of... Seven. Okay. So with a range of seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's about as good as it's going to get right there. So they've got basically they've got to be on the island. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, they've got to be on the island. All right. So you operate. go there. You operate. Going down to Syracuse. You can bombard from there. You operate. We're going to put all our buckets into Raider's plan. Not going to be this turn or next turn, but the turn after. Fix them all next time. We also need. We'd also like to upgrade them to get their their other stuff, but that's going to be fine. So we got a medium bomber here. What is the medium bomber's range? Okay, like I said, Rundstedt. You know what? We'll take Munstein to do this thing. For now, we'll give him the best possible chance make this happen. So we've got three TAC bombers so far. Let's make it four. And we've got one, two, I can only do six. One, two, three, four, five. So we're going to need another hit. Okay, we're going to need another headquarters. <clears throat> we're going to send two headquarters to the south. You know what, Kishla? You're going to go. You get good experience. You're going to go ahead and go as well. Here, along with a, another plane. Okay, now we got to start thinking about deploying units. <clears throat> so 
we want to get some armor units down there because we're going to put armor units down there. Okay, we can fix you. Okay, we can. F oh, you don't have enough supply to be fixed. Look at you. We're going to go ahead and move you up. Well, Nancy is eight, so we might as well move here. Okay. All right, everybody else, what are we going to take into Africa? Quick moving guys and armor. Okay, that's a core. Let's get you to here. That's a division. That's a core. Let's get you to here. I'm going to put all our eggs in this basket here. That's a core. So the plan is destroy this. I mean destroy Malta. Jump in, let the Italians have it. Okay, then destroy whatever fleets we can. Well, with long range. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Strike range nine, there you go. Destroy whatever we can long range. Get the armor over here. We may even want to put a maritime bomber on Malta to get good visibility on everything around here. That may be a thing. Okay, in the meantime, where is Yugoslavia sitting? Forty-five, which is fine. So we got Turkey. He's definitely doing stuff with Turkey. Definitely. So maybe I should do some stuff with Sweden. Or Norway for that matter. Finland is plus. Where's Spain sitting? Plus 31. Sweden's at 30. Norway's at 40. Okay. All right, you're going to stay there and cover all of this. We're going to need another one over here. So let's purchase, if we haven't already, another AA gun. We are going to need one, two, three, four, five. I think we bought two last time. Five garrisons. So three more. Do need to fix our units. So our units are fixed that need fixing. Gonna need these guys in the. 
So Rua doesn't have anybody, but Reams needs somebody. Do I have anybody that's just like sitting around? Garrison right now is fine. Sure, we have at least four units. We do. That's good. Uh, you're going to get upgraded. You're going to get reinforced. You're going to get upgraded. Research. I cannot do any more research, which is unfortunate because one shit per. Do I want to do anti-sub? Yeah. Although, maybe I do. Might as well. Alright, so that leaves us with 300 money. That leaves us with 300 money. You guys start going east. Stay here and cover. See, what do I want to buy? Heavy artillery, certainly a thing. Can't believe how much money I just spent. going to need more headquarters. So I think Loma comes out as a as an actual guy. So see they take to November. Course takes September. September. Tank destroyers cool. September. Heavy artillery August, so that'd be even quicker. We're going to want these guys as well. It's December. Okay, the first thing we're going to do... I need 400 for two of them. We're going to buy an armor unit. We want the bomber instead. I think I want the bomber first. I won't need naval weaponry by then. And still leaves me enough for an HQ. Okay. And now I'm out of money. And you just gotta not do that anymore. You're gonna be railed probably. If I had the money, I would rail you to Bordeaux. But we're going to need some for here as well. And we're going to have to fix these guys too. All right, so we're, next turn we fix here. The following turn we attack. Take Malta. Um, so we've got to get this guy going next turn as well to fix. And this one so that we can do a little bit of uh, shore bombardment as well. And put the fear of God in them here with our subs. So I think... I think we are done. We spent a lot. We're going to move you along. I think pretty soon the Hungarians and the Romanians and the Bulgarians will join us, I hope. <clears throat> 75. Hungary is at 84. And Romania is at... 63. They should be joining us sometime soon. All right, that's it. That's the state of the world right now. Looking good for the Axis. I got to fix him next turn as well. Might as well give you one.
you're going to be a one per turn because I think you're going to stay in Antwerp. Perhaps Brussels, I'm not sure. Oof, I'm going to need lots more units. I don't have nearly enough units right now. <clears throat> and headquarters. Not nearly enough. I'm going to need to buy headquarters a turn along with whatever. After the fall of France and installing the pro-German government in Vichy, Japan was able to profit from the new political situation in Southeast Asia and occupy French Indochina under the argument it has protected this area from the British. Uh, I don't know what they're asking me. If you say yes, Indochina will be annexed with three garrison, two infantry corps, and one HQ being deployed at the cost of 50 for six turns. Pushes the United States closer to war. Well, they're going to come to war anyway. We do get two cores, and we're going to spend 300. <sighs> French Indochina view map. That's this. And we'll come in behind them. I think that's worth it, because I'll be in behind them. Yes. Play me some good stuff here. Uh, Il Duce, the Italian command in North Africa, they believe are ill-equipped for an immediate offensive against Egypt. Our army is lacking motorization and supplies are extremely stretched. You can say that, that's for sure. We should consider rushing additional supplies and motorized equipment to Tobruk to support our plan. We should support the Italian command in North Africa deliver initial what do we get? I get a half strength mechanized division to deploy it to Brook. That's an additional unit. 35 for eight turns. Oh my god. That's 300 and some. Forty. It's two hundred and eighty. Oh, if I select no, I can expect significant supply reductions. I guess I got to say yes. It's really going to cut into my money. What? Okay, what else? These are all new, right? German exports to Italy may fear our allies have approached us with concerns that they need due to allied blockades. We have drawn a proposal to supply the Italians with these resources only until our planned invasion of Russia. 25 per turn. Do you approve of these exports? Yeah, I think I do. That blunts the uh, 35 down to yeah, I think I do. I approve. British forces mobilized in Egypt. Oh, God, look at that. That's perfect. I needed that. U.S. convoy sent to Liverpool. Oh, I forgot my submarines. I forgot about my submarines. We're going to have to take care of that next time. Logistics boost. Yeah, we actually got a little bit this time. Normally it's zero. <clears throat> Japan 235 Hey wait, how come I'm not getting to 25 down there? That ain't quite right. All right, you've been gaming with the Colonel. Please like, subscribe, come back early, come back often. For now, I'm out.